Today we're actually going to try and recreate a really cool experiment that went viral on YouTube a couple years ago. The only two things it needs, a jar and some ball chain. Let's check it out. So that was pretty weird, right? You wouldn't really expect the chain to come flying out of the jar like that. So in Steve Mould's original video, he explains the phenomenon by looking at momentum. You have beads on one side that are traveling very quickly downwards, and on the other side they're traveling very quickly upwards. Now Mould says the beads can't switch directions instantaneously, and so that's what creates the large arc. About a year later, however, there is another scientist named Dr. Biggins from the University of Cambridge who decided to look into this phenomena a little bit further. He found that Mould's explanation wasn't quite right. Instead, he found something really interesting. So we can think of the chain like a bunch of rods that are connected by moving joints. Not only do the beads get a pull downwards from gravity, but they actually get a push upwards from the jar. So what do you think is going on? If you're interested in investigating further, check out the links below. Or try the experiment for yourself at home. Alright, I'll see you guys next time.